All right. Let's see what he's bringing. I'm making tired old man noises. I'm like, <laughs> okay. So, Aleki, Finny, Moltres, Glacier, Trick Room, Kartana. I really like my lead with the Coco. I think Marowak always has to show up in the back, though. I think I do this. I think that's my best chance. Yeah, that does give me a lot of options. Um, Defensively, it's a little bit difficult, though. Maybe I should bring the Finny. Nah. Nah. I'm not doing that. It's for losers. Finny's for losers. Here's my deal with this match. If I lose, I'm cool with it, because that means I can go to sleep. If I win, it's whatever. But I would have preferred losing earlier. <laughs> So if I win this match, I better win every other match. So it looks like he's going screens Moltres. Me too. Me too, bro. Me too. I think I should always go for my screen here. Cause he's probably just gonna go for his own screen. I'll nasty plot up. This is a really it's a really risky play, but it can win me the game immediately if it works out. If it doesn't though, I just lose. If he goes for Electroweb. Alright, cool. He did light screen, so we called it gonna get mine up but I'm also gonna nasty plot are we did we just do like a mirror turn did we just mirror each other tell me we didn't just mirror each other oh my god we just did what the other person did that's hilarious okay also signed a note I forgot to open up his team sheet his only move that can hit me is Electro or Volt Switch. I want him to try to Volt Switch on me. I'll go ahead and I'll get in my Marowak here. And I will actually just Airstream his Moltres. I want him to try to Volt Switch. All right. Is I Dynamax? He's probably a bulkier variant than me. Because I think he should Dynamax here as well. If he doesn't, I end up in a pretty good spot. Yep, there it is. I think it's so funny that we're just doing a mirror. Hey, we caught him. Caught him lacking. There's his airstream. Wow. Okay, we just barely hung on. I'm 
Hmm. I'm actually pretty cool with him electrowebbing here, to be honest. What's a switching? If I win this War of Attrition, I'm, I'm in a pretty good spot. Um, I think I just let Marowak go down. And try to Flare Blitz the Moltres. Airstream into it as well. Okay, that's fine. He's going to get his Berserk, I don't care. Darkness. Good play, good play. I think here I send out my Coco. Yeah, I send out the Coco. And he's likely weakness policy, right? I think I'm just going to double down into the Aleki. Yeah. We'll double into Aleki, make sure we keep up the uh, offensive pressure. If he gives me my weakness policy, that isn't bad. I should take any hit from the Moltres. Hey, Atrix with the sub. Thank you, man. All right. Hey, okay, that's good. As he volt switches, I doubled into that, so something's dying. No, I'm not 1-1, one, one, I'm 2-1. Yo, that Kartana's gone. I think we just win with that play. Because now we outspeed his, um, we outspeed his Reggie Alecki every time. Yeah, I think we win with that one play. And this is the first, this is the first match of this set. Or the first game of this set. the Tapu Fini. I'll always eat a hit from Tapu Fini. That's good. So I think I just target down into um, I think I target down into his Moltres because that's the only real threat. I believe plus one Coco will always outspeed plus one Vultures, especially since his is confirmed slower than me. So I'll double down into it. Actually, there's no need to double into it. The Thunderbolt should pick up the KO, and I can just Fiery Wrath to play it safe. Because I just want to get that Moltres in range of my Thunderbolt. Just to make sure they aren't like a super, especially bulky version. Get my weakness policy, and that is a dead Alecky. Deady Alecky. He doesn't have Protect on it either, which is really good. So once the Alecky's gone, I win with my my Kartana in the back. I'm plus three on this guy, right? Yeah. So I always just go for this play. Uh, we'll double into the Alecky in case somehow it survives. And we'll Fiery Wrath, because we're not speed around Coco.
It did survive. Good thing we did this. Alright. That should be game. And we got the flinch. Nice. So I don't even reveal that I brought Kartana, which while it wouldn't reveal any information about the Kartana, it does reveal the fact that I felt confident in bringing it, which is pretty important when you consider the matchup. So he doesn't know that I'm willing to bring Kartana to this matchup. Game one to me. All right. The battle begin. I think my Moltres lead is still really good versus him. All things considered, that's it's it's a really solid lead. And I could also Dynamax to survive his hit, get the weakness policy in case he decides not to go for that. I think I just bring the same Pokemon every time. And if he tries to play some kind of mind games where he's like, okay, maybe I can... What's it called? Maybe I can go for like a... Different play. <laughs> what am I saying? In case he tries to like go for Electroweb on this play, what I can do is probably just one shot his Moltres. Because he can't afford not to set up Light Screen. So if he doesn't set up Light Screen, I'm in a good spot. And Mar Marowak's extremely good in the Trick Room matchup. Yeah, I'm facing Aaron Trailer. Are you lucky, Tapu Fini? I can live with that. Matter of fact, I like that lead quite a bit. Because it tells me he didn't bring Trick Room. That tells me he didn't bring Trick Room, and that matters. I'm going to protect here. I'm going to set up my screen. Yeah, set up my screen. He shouldn't feel comfortable going for Volt Switch. He should probably get his own screens up. And I think the way I win this match, if he ends up Dynamaxing his Finny, is playing conservatively until the Dynamax is over. And then winning with... Um... Oh, he's Choice Specs Finny, by the way. That's scary. And then winning with my Kartana. So I need this light screen. 100% need it. There's his light screen. It's probably gonna fire a choice specs attack off into me. I'll eat that. Not well, but I'll eat it. And I'll like it. So now he's locked into that. Um I think what I do here is I keep the Coco around for the Moltres. I can't Thunderbolt is the thing. This is risky. But he's locked into that move now, so 
feel somewhat comfortable. See Dynamaxes. That's gonna be scary. That's gonna be scary, but I should eat whatever, you know? And he shouldn't have gone for the water move. I don't think there's any situation he goes for the water move. Burning that Dynamax early is so good for me, especially if he Volt Switches here. Okay, he reflects, that's good. Oh, please be into Kartana. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's a crit. How many times today? How many times today will this happen to me? <laughs> Dang, that crit mattered a lot, actually. I mean, I can Dynamax and try to survive, but I have to protect here. Does Airstream into Overgrowth do it? I don't know. I think I have to Overgrowth. Maybe I Overgrowth the Aleki. I'm going to do that. I want to get rid of it. That crit mattered quite a bit. <laughs> I would have been in such a good spot here otherwise. See, Electro Web, can you miss me? No, that's fine. I'll survive this hit with screens and Dynamax, and I'll be able to remove that thing. And then I think I might have to end my Dynamax early to save my Kartana. Okay. Oh wow, that didn't KO. That is so sad. That is so sad. I mean, I can KO it this turn with Shadow Bone, but I thought that would do it. Send in the Moltres. I'm ending my Dynamax early. I have to remove a Lucky, and then I can start winning with my Kartana. And his screens have to go away. That's that's another big thing. Critical hit. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it, game. Just keep do just keep giving me those. I think I might have lived that actually. If it weren't for the crit, since I'm behind screens and such. Thank you, game. I, I appreciate you so much. Nice. Okay. We're not in a losing position just yet, but we're also not in a winning position, so. He's also locked into Moonblast right now. When he undynamaxes. There's his Kartana. So I have to protect here every time. And I can go for the Flare Blitz into his Kartana to KO it since he won't be able to knock me out. Is he has Salt Vest? He has Salt Vest, so this will KO.
I think I just let Moltres go down. And I try to Fiery Wrath. He shouldn't be able to knock me out. Because his Finny's, his Finny's still locked into Moonblast. So I can KO this Kartana. I hope this does enough. Because he is in the rain. But this is also a Marowak, so... I think we're good. As long as I don't get crit or anything. Moonblast into an attack will never knock out my Marowak. That's fine. And now he's stuck using Moonblast. Yep. That won't KO unless he crits. Okay. Don't really care about that. Nice, okay. Gonna take a lot of damage though. We still don't know what he has in the back. It's probably his Moltres. So... Finny's choice spec, so Kartana's the right play here. It's Glacier. Okay. This is doable. Finny can't protect itself and it's locked into a move. I have to wait for the rain to run out. There's one turn left of rain. So the correct play here would be to Leaf Blade into the Finny and protect my Marowak. And then next turn, I have to hope that Dazzling Gleam does enough. Otherwise, I'm in trouble. Because I can't Thunderbolt. Maybe I can get a lucky crit. Hmm. Not in the cards. My horsepower... It's gonna KO. Chilling Nay. He does have Protect on this thing, but I don't think he ever protects it in this situation. Yeah, I need to crit the Finny. Please? Nope. Maybe I'll survive. No, not in the cards. Oh well. Maybe he'll miss. Nope. Alright. I mean, I played that one, I think, pretty perfectly, to be honest. Unfortunately, the crit on the Kartana earlier was kind of bad, and the crit on the on the Moltres is pretty bad. Alright, play the same rules. Alright. I definitely think I bring the same thing. Marowak is so good in the matchup. Seed Kartana Coco. Marowak in the back. Moltres. Or maybe this time I actually bring the, the Finny. Nah. Nah. Coco doesn't get Electroweb. Not this gen.
I think I just play super aggro with my, uh... I just play super aggro with my Kartana. That's probably how I win this. And Oleki is really the, the Mon that's annoying here. Okay, I can live with that. Yeah, no, that's fine. So I should just get a reflect up here and get in my um get in my Marowak as he tries to remove the cocoa. Reflect up. the hailstorm. We live that. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Are you kidding me? Y you're kidding me, right? Why is this happening to me today? Can someone explain how this is happening to me? Because that actually matters so much. Because now I can't even go for my Burning Jealousy to try to counter him. I just have to hope that I just crit him. This is so annoying. Alright. Get in the Kartana. That's so annoying, dude. I mean, what's his play here, really? He could just Hailstorm the Kartana. I guess I just sack Moltres and hope, you know? And this isn't going to one-shot without a crit. So this Hailstorm. The Sack and the Moltres. He's not going to go for Quake because Burning Jealousy was an option I had. Please do enough. Okay. There's someone honking their freaking horn. Alright, cool. Revenge crit. Revenge crit. Alright. Send in the Kartana. This is somewhat doable. That's his Kartana. He could double out into Finny. 
I'm going to say he's probably going to double out into Finny here. I have no reason to predict. I'll just Phantasm and try to knock out his Dusclops. Because if I get this call right, I just win. Ah, oh, well, I didn't even need that, apparently. That actually might have lost me the match, if I, if I, um... Wow, that read might have lost me the match. Sacred Sword, can I live? Oh my god, just barely. Thank you. Thank you, light screen. Thank you. There's this Tapu Fini. He has choice specs, which is kind of scary. I just double down into the Finny. It's okay if Kartana gets an attack boost, as long as I leave it on the field. Dang, I could have won right there. Finny can't protect or anything. Not a one shot, unfortunately. I need to survive this hit with my Kartana. Oh, Kartana! No! Please, Kartana, don't do this! Okay. <sighs> Alright. I'm behind screens. He has to crit to kill. He's plus one, but I resist the hit. He has to crit. Don't do this to me now, game. Don't do this to me now, game. Oh, wait. Yeah, we still have a turn trick room. Good game. <laughs> Oh my god, that was the worst. Well played. That was the worst, dude. I got the revenge crit though, so I guess that's good. <laughs> Finally. <laughs>